Welcome to my YouTube channel, I guess. Hello, my name's Emily Knight and there are children screaming outside my window. So welcome to my new channel. I feel like I'm kind of just screaming out into the void at this point. There might not be anyone watching and that's so fine. Um, I did used to have a YouTube channel um, in my old name. I still do, don't know why I'm talking in past tense. That still is around on the internet, uh, which is in my real name. Um, and I was still occasionally uploading on it. I don't think I've uploaded since Christmas, but mm. but I've decided to make a new channel, a fresh start, because I want to do different things on it. Um, so I'm going to explain in this video a little bit about my old channel and what I was doing and where I'm at with that, and then what I'd like to do on this channel. So after watching this video, if you're interested in the kind of content that I'm hoping to make, or if you just enjoy me as a person, then uh, do consider subscribing. It would be very nice to have someone listening, um, but also not essential. Um, <laughs> when I was younger, I was too afraid to make talky talky kind of videos, but it's got to the point now, as I am 22, nearly 23 years old, that I've just started making YouTube videos in my head. Like, I can't do my makeup without doing a chatty get ready with me. I can't make lunch without pretending I'm doing a what I eat in the day. And so it's got to the point where I may as well just make the bloody video. <laughs> So it would be lovely if someone does watch it. Whereas before I thought it would be sad to make this kind of YouTube video, now I think it's more sad to just make it in my head and not just make it in real life. So I'm decided to just make them. And um, to be honest, since I've started making some YouTube videos, because I have pre-filmed some, um, I feel like I've done less talking to myself and pretending to make YouTube videos. So I think it's it sounds a lot healthier to be honest. So my old channel I made back in 2012 but I didn't upload on it until I think 2013 because I was too shy. What happened was <laughs> I sent a video of me singing to my friend. Now I can only hope and pray that uh, he asked, he said, oh, you sing, send me a video of you singing. And I didn't just go, um, but to be honest, I wouldn't put that past me. <laughs> The more I think about it though, I was really shy to do that kind of thing when I was younger, so I'm hoping that he asked. And so I sent him a cover of an Adele song, which was all about love, which is a really subtle thing to send to a boy that you really like. Anyway, he said it was great, and he said you should put it on YouTube, and I was like, what? He was like, yeah, come on, I'll be your manager. Shut up. He was like, yeah, come on, I'll be your manager. He was obviously joking about that bit, but he said he meant the bit about putting it on YouTube. And so eventually I was like, okay, I will. And so instead of re-recording it, because this one was just made for him, so there's lots of like awkward like <laughs> giggles and like the interludes and stuff, I didn't like re-record it. I just uh, put it up as I sent to him, which uh, I still have online me singing at 15 on a potato of a webcam that I'm filming it on uh, in black and white so you can't tell the garish colours of the wall behind me. Um, uh, it's not good. I think it was filmed before I'd even ever had a proper singing lesson, like one to one, so not my best work. But And I think I had a retainer in. But that was my first ever YouTube video and it's still up there now. So I hit upload, I refreshed the page, saw that it didn't have any views and cried. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I think I had a panic attack basically because I was so scared of putting myself out there This was at a time where I didn't even share it on my Facebook which would have actually got it views um, Because yeah, this was back when I didn't really share things like that Which is so funny now because if you know me all I do is share my stuff online like watch this I'm doing this so yeah that took me a while to recover from that I think the next thing I uploaded was um, a birthday video for my friend so it wasn't like a proper cover um, but by this point I had new tech I had a laptop like a macbook I had a microphone so I was using GarageBand and so I recorded happy birthday with a little video and the easiest way to get that to her post on her Facebook wall was just by putting it on my channel so that's still on there as well um, and then after that I slowly was like I'm gonna post something. So it was quite a while, I think, after, um, probably like a year after I posted my first very cringy video. Um, and yeah, from there I just started posting covers and all of them are still on there. And to be honest, I like them all, even if they're not my best singing I, or my best playing, I know that, you know, I had a lot of fun working on them and you can see the progress, hopefully, up to now. But like most of them on there, I don't know that I would do a better job now. Like, I'm quite happy with them. That, they're still there floating around and I got really into putting a video to them as well not always just recording it like this but uh, like putting recording little bits of um, holidays and stuff like that and putting it into a video so um, I really enjoyed that creative side of it because I just like to make things um, which is why I'm back on this to be honest I just like to make things and I know most people started their channels at the start of lockdown. Uh, to be honest, I did start filming at the start of lockdown. I just haven't uploaded them. I've got a little backlog, um, like backed up. I just like to make things and I'm very excited to be doing that again.
So yeah, my channel was just for music. I posted covers of musical theatre songs, pop songs, rock songs, and all sorts. Um, some of them were just straight to camera. Most of them I played. I didn't use a backing track on many of them. And I got into a bit of a tradition of doing at least a Christmas video and or a New Year's video, sort of summarizing my Christmas and my year, um, which I really enjoyed. And yeah, like I say, I still did one last Christmas, so kept that up. So yeah, I had a YouTube channel full of musicy things. And then as I went to uni, I still uploaded every now and then. I really wanted them all to be perfect. And so I found putting little snippets on Instagram really useful for works in progress or things where I didn't feel like they were perfect or like had a really exciting video and that was back on Instagram where you could only upload a minute at a time so um, I would just upload little snippets of songs and that is something that sort of took over from YouTube and I started to do that a lot more and so what I've decided to do is keep posting on my Facebook and my Instagram I made new ones last year under my stage name Emily Knight and so I upload covers on there quite regularly and then this is my new YouTube channel which is where I'm going to post some talky talky kind of videos so I might still upload some music stuff I will explain in a minute that I've got some uh, covers coming up on here but I think I would like this to be a space where I do more talking to camera videos so I like I say I've pre-filmed some stuff I used to live in Derby at the start of lockdown and so I filmed uh, sort of hang out with me in the kitchen kind of video, I filmed a weekend vlog, I filmed me moving out of that house, um, so I filmed some stuff like that. Um, I also have lots of interest in like makeup and fashion, so um, I might do some videos on that. I'm also interested in doing things like what I eat in a day videos, I really like that kind of thing, and maybe like routines like morning routine, bedtime routine, that kind of thing. Um, and in general, I just would love to do some little vlogs of my life. So um, if you don't know, I am a performer, I'm a singer, actor, dancer, uh, and a musician. So if I have anything to do with that and you want to see some behind the scenes stuff on that kind of thing, then um, that's worth subscribing for. I'm also a teacher, so at the moment I'm working as a TA in traditional school and I also work as a singing teacher, an acting teacher and if anyone wants me a dance teacher. So there might be some behind the scenes stuff of that as well as I go about my life. So if you're interested in any of those kinds of things, just basically if you enjoy me and you're like, I would watch her talk to me, you know, I just like to make things for you to put in the background while you do your makeup or cook or whatever like that. So as well as maybe some covers and music stuff as well, then do subscribe to my channel to be notified when I make those kinds of things. I don't know how often I'll be uploading. Now I've moved, I, you know, my life's a bit crazy, but I'm gonna try and I'd really like to make things, like I said. So if you wanna see the music-y stuff, please follow me on my Instagram and my Facebook, which I will leave down below. And also, yeah, subscribe to here to see maybe more talky kind of videos and behind the scenes stuff about my life. I only moved in this week. I'm not finding these children crying all the time the best thing. So maybe I won't be able to film ever. <laughs> this is the end of the channel, bye guys. So what's gonna happen on this channel? From Monday, I'm starting a new series on my Facebook and Instagram, and I'm gonna post them on here too, which is gonna be collab week. So every day, Monday to Sunday, hopefully, I'm gonna post a musical theatre cover, each one featuring at least one friend of mine um, in collaboration. So if you are interested in musical theatre covers, then definitely subscribe, because there's uh, hopefully seven coming uh, in the next few days. Um, and then I think I'll slowly start to upload some of the things if I feel like they're at all interesting. They're probably not. I recorded them so many months ago now, but I will probably start to record those things that I filmed in Derby and stuff like that. And then we'll probably catch up with each other and I'll have some videos of my life here. So yeah, if you're interested in seeing those kind of things that I've already filmed, uh, the musical theatre covers, and then anything in the future that revolves around my life, um, then please do subscribe and um, I will see you for those videos as I upload them. So thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you come on this journey with me. Journey. <laughs> Like I said, it would be lovely if someone's listening, but at this point, I just make these in my head anyway, so I may as well put them on here. So um, you don't, if, <laughs> so if you're not interested, that's all right. So hopefully I'll see you on Monday for some musical theatre covers, and if not, hopefully I will see you soon. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.